All right, I've been inspired by Jason the Hitman to do a video with some commentary of some of my matches with the Midwest. Midwest Terror. So we do randoms a lot. And, uh, not very good at commentary. I will try my best. Katana Mirror. Obviously a match. I love any match with Katana. But feel the pressure. Don't want to lose with my best character. Especially to another Katana. same time. I get him with the instant fans sometimes. Double fan, lots of blood. There's another match that I love. I've trouble with Jax on Fight Kate. I can't quite. He's just so slow and clunky on there. I'm, on PS3, I can like PS3, I can ground pound under under size spam a lot better than I can on Fight Kate. I just haven't gotten the timing of that down very well. Luckily, he can punish her roll with a pretty big combo with the jump kick. Backbreaker. Oh, this was a... He, he always seems to get this match up against me. It's one of the worst in the game. It's almost impossible to beat Molina. To be a great Molina with Reptile. I have not lost this match since 2011, so, you know, I've lost every other match in MK, MK2 at some point since then, but this one just, I suppose, you know, you don't see it too often because nobody's stupid enough to pick Reptile against Molina, other than me, because <laughs> I do like it from Reptile's perspective as well, it's a fun match for me, either way. He always seems to, to get that on randoms, and I'm like, it's just unlucky. Now, Midwest, he loves his Raiden, and he is a very good Raiden. He's very good at sneaking in the shock, the shock grabs. So you always gotta be careful when he gets get too close to like that because he just lets it loose and always seems to connect but Johnny Cage Raiden is a very even match super fun match let's see Johnny can punish Superman's with a shadow kick if you time it right throw on me. Sneaky. Raiden's throw does the least amount of damage of anybody's throw, though, so it only does like 12% 12, 12 damage, whereas somebody like Baracus does 21, so it's a pretty big difference. 
up top mirror. Best mirror in MK2 right here. I'm pretty sure I try to go invisible as much as possible. the key to victory with Reptile in most matchups. Even if you can't stay invisible, like against somebody like Raiden, it forces uh, your opponent to do something that you can block. Because they're gonna do like a uh, like with Raiden, he's gonna do a Superman to try to make you visible. And you can anticipate that and then punish it. I'm invisible again. This was a good start for me, I have to say, usually. Usually I don't start out 5-0 against Midwest, it's too good. And his Midwest, he he has a way of winning the almost impossible matches to win. Not that Baraka Lou's impossible, but definitely is. Lou has a pretty big advantage in this matchup. And, uh, Midwest usually. He surprises me with. He, he beats me in this match a lot, so. Gotta take him serious, even if it seems like it would be an easy matchup on paper. But he's just very smart. Rematch. Johnny Cage rematch against Raiden. Ah, uh, he almost got me with that. Double shadow kick. A lot of times you can get people with that because they're just not expecting it. You to do it twice. Triple low toes for the win. That, that was a bit of a fluke, because usually when we when we do this matchup, it's like third round, double danger. Just I had all the reads, I guess, correctly in that one. Now speaking of impossible matches, beating Jax with Scorpion is damn near impossible. But I believe Midwest has beaten me before. I know he beat me. He beat my Jax with a reptile before, which I think the hardest match to win in, in the game. So. Very nice. See, even when you even when you outplay Jax, he 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 wins. Like he definitely should have won that round, but just Scorpion just doesn't have the weapons to Get it done. Oh boy. Smoke battle coming. Smoke is the hardest 
Jade's... Jade's pretty easy to beat. Noob Cybot is... Noob Cybot's the easiest, I think. But Smoke is just so hard. He has this unblockable run forward throw move. Right there. It's like from half screen. You can't do anything about it. Try and just no luck. All right, Jack's Johnny. It's a very hard match for Johnny Cage, but online it's a little easier to a little easier to pressure Jacks because it's so clunky and slow. I'm just, you, you gotta be on him all the time. Johnny's not gonna win from far away, so you gotta just get in on him. That was, a, that was another fluke. That, that should not happen. Another very terrible matchup for Midwest here, but he plays it super well. He's really good with Sub, Sub and Reptile and Raiden. Those are his best characters in my opinion. So yet again, you see Reptile outplaying me, but Jack still comes through. Very smart, goes invisible. I'm not doing a whole hell of a lot to keep him from going invisible. Double ground pound. People when I would play my friends on PlayStation, they would get they would get mad if I did that. Double ground pounds against reptile. Like, are you seriously gonna do that against reptile? Hell yeah, because I don't want to lose this match. It's the most embarrassing thing in the game. So, just winning a round against uh, Jax with Reptile is, is a victory in itself. Now, I'm starting to sweat here a little bit. I'm like, God. Looking good. But with Jax, you can never never count him out. He just does big damage. Pretty hard to count. It's pretty hard to block and punish the slides on Fightcade or online in general, as opposed to uh, as opposed to offline. He's very good at this match as well. Any match with Sub Zero, he, he never. You always gotta take him super seriously because he's beating my jacks with Sub Zero, which you know, is super difficult to do. Bit of frozen posing. I caught him with the fan. 
He's hard to get in. He's hard to get in on. Um, oh. <laughs> he's hard to get. He always he, he always sneaks that ground ice in. Got me again. If I can get him in a corner, then. I'm very happy, but he's doing a very good job of not letting that happen. I gave him an excellent for that because that's a good, good win. That was one of the hardest for my Molina. It's just, it's just it's, mm. his hitboxes are so strange, I guess. And in the in the air, he can really do some damage against her. match for Katana to win. Molina. Molina takes her out pretty easily, but if you do make a mistake against Katana, she has huge damage punishes, so you can't... You can't be stupid with your rolls. She'll do a fan raise, and that's 50 plus percent. <laughs> Just spamming away. uppercuts quite often, but it's going to happen when you're trying to be aggressive. going to eat a couple. An uppercut of my own, okay. People usually don't expect that with Molina because you're usually holding high punch for the Psy. So they usually don't think you're going to anti-air uppercut them. It's another match I love, Raiden against Baraka. Well, I love it from Baraka's standpoint. It's a pretty even matchup. That would give a slight edge to Baraka, however. Tried to do the shredder there. Had to re 
reset because after a certain number of matches, the sound gets all staticky on here. So you have to reset the game after a certain amount of time. Shock back. Whiffed on the roundhouse, though. That's why I usually go with the high kick. Does a little bit less damage, but it's safer. Like that. Good. He's very good, as I said, with Sub Zero. And... <laughs> I was waiting for that one, though. He's beat me more than once with uh, Sub against Lou. So, playing, playing very conservative here. him down. Just trying to chip him down a little by little. Oh my god. Yep. <laughs> this is another match he gets all the time. Lou versus Baraka. Wonder if this might be one where he beat me. For me, I've never been very good at it with Lou. Very nice. Yeah, he just plays real smart. And I jump around like an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know when you be top tier with low tier, you got to do a fatality. He hates Liu Kang. Just he he, uh, <laughs> he makes that very uh, clear when when we chat. But he ain't bad with Lou. He just you know, doesn't like him. Oh, 
Just trying to get in safely with carriage abs. That's the goal is to get him in a corner. Hard match for Reptile. As most matches in the game are. I mean, and he's got a good Reptile too. Lau's just so fast, you know, I mean... Alright. Another uh, pretty even matchup here. Baraka Scorpion. Baraka wants to get in. And win with that jab pressure. It's also kind of hard for Scorpion to anti-air that jump kick or jump punch. I like to use those uh, blade sparks. I like to use them to bait Scorpion into teleporting because at least then he's near you. And then, oh, that's that stupid... Uh, Stupid takedown that comes out sometimes when you try to do a sweep kick and it costs him the round there. If Baraka wasn't so clunky to move because of his his walk cycle, he would be a lot more fun, I have to say. I do I do love him, but Sometimes it's like you're in molasses, you know, running through molasses, playing with characters like Baraka and Jax, Shang. They all have that delayed walk cycle. Johnny Cage. There's the jab. That's what Baraka wants. And that's what Scorpio wants. <laughs> One of those spears connect. Another very difficult match to win. We got some bad randoms, that's for sure. <laughs> Raiden just has the advantage in just about every way, so... 
going invisible against him doesn't do a whole lot because Raven can find you so easily with the teleport. Superman. Maybe you get some better matchups here. There you go. No, he got Molina here, so. He finally has an advantage in one of these matches. But I don't, I don't lose too often on the portal stage. This is like, for some reason, my best stage. I just, I guess I see, see things the best on here. Not to mention it's, the fucking coolest stage ever. Takes top tier to beat top tier, I guess. Brain fart there. No comment. an unsuccessful morph with Katana. left and right. I think this is the one. The match where he pulls off the near impossible. this match very often, but Reptile's pretty good against Katana, especially when he's invisible. It's very hard for her to find him. jumping on that force ball here. That was... That threw me off the whole round, I remember. I low-toed and it, like, she just stood there. I was like, what the hell? What the... Tasty snack for reptile. That's what I mean about Midwest though. He wins the matches that are like almost impossible to win. He pulls them off. He's a player. I'm probably so rattled at this point that I lost to reptile with my katana. Probably need a few rounds to regroup here. I don't remember. I don't remember what happened. Round 
<laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> Just... I don't know. Right into it. My face is a magnet for those fans. Low kick is very good at ending rounds when you just need a little bit of damage like that. And again, face first into it. <laughs> that time I got over it though. This is looking like it's gonna be unsuccessful. Let's see if I can stage a comeback here. Oh, gave me two high kicks there. That's 40% damage. scary up close, so I'm trying to keep my distance, especially when I'm almost dead. Oh man, don't know how I won that round. It's a pretty even match as well, which is kind of a surprise considering how far apart they are on the tier. I did not mean to do that, but it connected, so I will just say yes, I was trying to do a rising uppercut. Alright, my, my chance to take on Lao with Reptile. I like this match. Eh, I like most matches in in the game. But... Never shied away from the hard matches. Plus it's reptile, I mean. Probably the only person on the planet that likes playing Molina with reptile, so... from here, that hurt. I flew into like outer space when I hit that spin. Nice. Fatal fatality there. <laughs> he did it on purpose, I'm sure. distance. <laughs> he, 
he's very good at keeping you away. Uh, I like to be aggressive, but he, he's pretty good at negating my jab pressure. Kick finisher combo. All right, some reptile Lou action here. Like I said, he hates Lou, but he's not. He's not bad with him. Ninja to fight Blue. Although most people would probably say Sub. Sub is the best, but. I guess I'm partial because Reptile is one of my favorites and Sub is my least favorite. supposed to be an uppercut, but sometimes when you try to uppercut, you go invisible instead because of the input of the invisible visibility. And um, I absolutely stole that round out of nowhere. I was just kind of like giving up, preparing for the next round, and then somehow pull it off. Alright. My shot at trying to win one of the impossible MK2 matchups here. It's it's easier to win online though than it is offline because Jax, like I said, you can you can pressure him a bit better online because of the delay. It's not too bad when I play. Midwest, because we're we live pretty close, but it's still a hell of a lot harder to win this offline. against me so that was that was like the one out of ten matchups matches that you're gonna win scorpion versus Jax. you know it's funny because you're you're we're picking random and there's like 78 possible matchups right so here we are in the 30th match and we've already had multiples like would think maybe it would reverse like I would get Molina this time and he would get Shang but it's weird like that a lot of times the random it just gives you the same matchup you can hear the sound because we've been playing about 15 matches since I last reset the game to say. I thought Raiden would be a pretty good pick against his Molina, but it did not turn out so. There we go. Sound is sound has been restored back to normal. 
So we did have this match already, but I had Cage last time, so. He's got a good Cage, that's one, one character I did not give him praise for yet, his Cages. He beat my uh, Jax with Cage last night, I think. And he beat my Katana twice with Cage, which is almost... Uh, that's one of the easiest matches for Katana. I just couldn't believe it. I'm like, how the hell am I losing to any Cage with Katana? <laughs> but he's sneaky solid. Nice whiff. Lao's uppercut has that missing frame, so if you don't time it just right, you're gonna whiff on the uppercut. First into Johnny's green balls. Oh boy, that sounded bad. Sounded a lot better when I went face first into Katana's fans. Uh, here we go again. See, another match we've already had. Not that I would complain while I'm playing, but it's just kind of funny that it's random and there's so many different possibilities and uh, it gives us the same match we've had, we've had already. Double kick there, jump kick, and then a dive kick. <laughs> God, this is like three uppercuts in a row. <laughs> My face is an uppercut magnet as well. Not that time. I finished it with an uppercut of my own. So. This is a even matchup as well, Shang Katana. It's like an uppercut fest here. Wow. That's why Katana is dangerous against even Molina. That's 52%, I think. Jump kick fan, jump kick. Okay, get a crack at Molina here with Raiden after he, uh, destroyed me when I morphed into Raiden with Shang in the last one of the last matches. Raiden is very good against Molina. She still wins the match overall. But considering how far apart they are on the tier, it's uh, pretty surprising that he is good against her.
matches with Raiden are always very entertaining because you just you never know where he's going to end up. <laughs> Finally, I'm like, okay, screw it. I'm throwing lightning here. Besides that, it's gonna give me a Raiden, I guess. A bunch of times here. Shang is very good against Raiden. It's a, probably a 6-4 match, I think. Because if he gets in on Raiden, he can, he can jab him to death. So He's also, if, if Shang puts himself in a corner, there's not a whole lot Raiden can do other than just back off and wait for this shit to stop. against his ninjas with Lao, but his scorpion. Uh, his scorpion gives me some fits. Round in my pocket, but here comes Midwest. Yeah, he, he doesn't fall for that. He doesn't fall for the jump kick, dive kick. He's he's been around the block too many times. a lot of our matches are they come down to down to the wire like that Fight. <laughs> 
He doesn't, he doesn't fall for much. <laughs> are very close. Score might uh, say it's not close, but I gotta work. I gotta work for every match against him. Okay, it's the portal. I can't lose. I don't lose in the portal. Maybe I do. <laughs> A fireball frenzy between Lou and Shang. So close. Almost had him in the trap. The infinite morph trap. Alright. The portal comes through yet again. Thank you, portal. Yeah, I don't know how many matches we played, but... I'm gonna have to make this the last one because this video is almost at an hour. I wasn't doing walk, walking carrot jabs because that would have, like that, would have prevented uh, me from getting hit by slides, most likely. Hey, I countered. I mean, I punished a, I punished a slide. It's really annoying when you're sitting there waiting for a slide. And then your opponent does it and you block and you can't punish it. Like, what? <laughs> Oof. That was close. Come back here. <sighs> Got him. All right. Hope the commentary comes through. Hope you can hear me well enough to make these interesting. 